hi guys welcome to this video this importation blueprints okay in this video i'll be showing you how to use canva so if you are using android phone just go to play store and type canva okay the first one you can see this one yes and if you are using uh, iphone just do the same thing go to app store this is the icon of what we are uh, downloading then you can see i've already have it this is my own just here i should update but i'm not updating now so let's open canva i just want to show you guys how to make simple instagram posts like just design of instagram posts skip i beg skip so this is how your own page you look like you have to sign up okay you don't sign up you have to just like signing up on facebook or instagram so once you sign up this is how it, it works so if you look down here this home these are uh, designs this is the menu okay and this is the plus so uh, the one we are focusing on is this instagram post okay so if you click on see all you see so many templates like there are just a lot of them and most of them are free and you can also register for subscribe to canva pro or the premium one so you can enjoy some benefit but majorly most of them are free and you can just choose from any template here and you know you can create your design towards it you can see so many templates that you can just easily edit and use so i'm trying to find one so i can just tap on it and uh, you can see most of them are free so let's choose this one let's choose this so i believe by now you should have your brand color you should not just be making posts with uh, rainbow color you should have your brand color by now so once you click on any of the templates you have something like this so if what you want to design is something related to this you just have to replace just like removing and you know replace if you like this font you can go for it or just change so if i'm going for this now let's say i want to wish wish my uh customers happy mother's day so happy mother's day okay so you position it i've typed it finished so assuming i want to change this font now there are so many there are so many features down here i can i can't explain all finish because this just basically edit this delete if you want to duplicate that same right up then you change font here font size there are many of them you just have to scroll this is the font color the format you want it to be the spacing how you want the space to be the effect you just have to click on some of them to you know try them out like there are so many of them so many so i like this font if i want to change the font i can just go to font and choose from the available font you can see there are so many fonts here those ones that have the can those ones that have crown that's for the premium one you can use them for free so but there are so many that are free share so i like this font and i'm going for this and let's say i want to change this background color this golden yellow i will click on that golden yellow then come to color here go to color then let's say my if my background color if my own color is uh let's say this green yes you understand let's say i'm using green and white okay i've changed it and if i want to choose color here you can see so many colors okay you can choose so many colors here once you are done you click on done so if i'm not okay with this black i can change the color just pick click on it then scroll down here the color if you want to change it to white then done then if you this particular 
small write-up that is done if i don't want it i go to delete okay and i click on delete so if i want to put another write-up now i can go to this plus this plus you click on this plus then you go to test go to test you choose just choose any of these and edit them and there are some that you can actually use from all these and you can edit as well there are so many things you can do on this app i'm just trying to show you guys part of it you have if you click on this plus alone this plus alone will take like an hour before i explain it's finished <laughs> you see this template upload photos element test audio video glory background for that there are so many of them sure but the more you use the app the more you know about it so now if i want to like change this image to maybe uh mothers let me let's just find uh someone's mother on this internet street and put it there then click on this replace I want to replace that picture there so you can choose from different source mm? you can choose from different source if you look here this is the upload the one that i've uploaded before the photos videos glary you can just go to your glary if you have it before or you click on this upload media you can go to your glary and upload media okay so uh, okay i think i've i saw one of my students here my so when you choose the picture you can just navigate you know shift also this particular one too you can do so so let's say what i just did now i want to undo it this is the icon of undo so just tap on it tap on it you see it has positioned back so if you want to add anything don't forget this plus is what you'll be using okay you can have a template upload or picture or audio that you want to put also you can put it let's say okay let me choose this template you know, not template let's go to elements these elements you can scroll and choose elements here yes so these are some that i've been using before you can choose from the elements there is the one that i want to show you guys network yeah, i'm still on the, the recent recently used uh, let me just type let me just yes let's say instagram icon let's say i want to add my page name something like that okay this network want to slow us down hmm? this network was to show but if if it shows you will just have to tap on any of those results that it brings okay you just have to tap on it but that's not where we are going then another thing i would like to talk on is this this is the page you are working on if you click on it Let's say we are working on two or more pages now. This particular place will show you how many pages you are working on and you can navigate through them. You can pick from pages. You can pick from pages. If you click on this, you can plus the page. And also, when you are saving, if you want to save, if you want to save, if you want to save a page now or anything, just come here. Okay? click on it so when you click on it when you are saving as image okay we are working on image if it is animation or the video is attached now you will save as mp4 video something like that so just click on it so that means it's loading and it will save but if we have and you can see done you already have it you can just go to your instagram and upload so here it shows you continue editing or go to home page so let's just click on continue editing and another thing is if you want to go back here just double tap on it and if i want to like add more page now i can just 
throw to the right like this and it ought to okay sorry i think i close back the stuff let's go back let's go back so don't forget canva we always and automatically save your works okay so make sure you are using good network i'm trying to show you guys something so you can just duplicate this editor duplicate then click on duplicate you can see we now have two pages so this is the page we are working on. i can change this on bagman to this or something like this okay you just have to choose your brand color and you maintain or something like that so let's go back to this plus and see if the network is okay so i can like choose elements from uh, those available one and you know just pick from them so yes this is the phone icon so just bring this one down you can delete just the, this is the full icon so let's say we are using phone icon now if i want to add uh, just this now just this particular side you can just shift it to the left you can see and move it you can rotate in you see to your taste okay to your taste you see let's put this one here you just have to be somehow creative eh? you have to be somehow creative then this particular picture now i want to move it inside this phone just drag it so to that phone side then it will be, or enter that side then let's say i want to change this background now i can just always click on it then go to color and see suitable background yeah let's say i choose this done then i want to change this so just put it in mind that if you are using dull background your right up should be light and if you are using light background your right top should be dull so let that principle just follow that principle okay i think we are cool with this just click on done then i can go to the plus again at the down left side click on tests and add let's say i want to add my page name just click on any of those things that i spend a lot of time then click on edit at the down let's say at importation underscore blueprint 2 okay so you can see the test is not balanced don't forget this side that i mentioned that you used to adjust this so now i want to reduce it go go down first then let the length be on the same row okay so this is what i'm saying you can just position this one down here then if i want to add instagram icon now just go to this same plus click on plus then go to elements it's first other elements go to elements and uh, let it load i think i saw it the other time yes this is it then choose it then you can drag it you can drag it to anywhere you want okay let's say i want to zoom out now you just have to place your two fingers on that particular side you want to drag then zoom out just place your two fingers and zoom out so you can navigate well so this one now you can just drag increase decrease eh? okay and when you are done just drag back <laughs> you just have to drag back and you are here so this just a simple template then i can save this and post and you don't have to pay any graphic designer for this now you have saved money okay with this now this mostly what i use uh, unless i want to like uh design a, a, a project that i use graphic designer or design it myself okay so this is how it works you can check other features and navigate it there are so many that i can't really put inside one video okay if i'm to do that i will be spending hours okay and this is just a tutorial like it's just a tutorial rather it's not a full i don't teach a uh, canva like that i just want you guys to have 
basic knowledge of the design stuff you can check other parts of Canva. there are a lot there for you to know about then don't forget this the page so if i'm saving now and i don't want to save all the two pages now don't forget if you want to save you come here so i click on it then if you go to save as image you know it is as image let's cancel i think okay let me check this it's up to give me okay that's direct save it's up to give me op uh, options like okay there is let's have a there is new features on this canvas self schedule you can schedule this particular post auto automatically to your uh instagram you understand you can check it out as well but what i want to do okay let me go to the home page and use the existing design i'm using i don't know why that one don't want to bring it let's say something like this now and i don't want to save all the pages i have like 19 pages here but okay it's 27 this is where you see the no total number of pages so let's say i want to save it now and i don't want to save it all okay you, you see this avas go to save us that's what i'm saying about this mp4 if video is uh, inside the template also it will always bring it or if you are saving anything animated or video it will bring this mp4 it is just type okay so there are different type here this png is high quality you can see so pdf standard also and you are not using pdf for this so normally this for image this is what i choose and for video this is what i choose so for image now i choose this png then go to the pages down here choose the page i want to save you can just mark it and then you click on done okay when you click on done you click on download it will go you see this particular page uh, part now is for those who subscribe editor you see this crown is for the people that people where they give canva money you can see there are so you can just navigate through there are so many things you will learn here so i hope this video help and you you have you have a lot of work to do on canva if you are new to designing in general choose your brand color and so many other things like that and believe me you guys are you are cool you have a lot to do like all this all this icon down here you see they have different different work that they do okay positioning noise animate you see you can choose you can choose uh, you see so <laughs> there are a lot that this particular thing can do there are a lot like a lot so this just like an introduction i hope these are uh, apps are on out there okay so you can follow see this is my instagram page you can follow us for more yes for more you can follow for more and also just so there are a lot you can do with that see you guys in the next video okay